Welcome back to Pace Immigration, paceimmigration.com, talking once again with uh, Pace Immigration lawyer extraordinaire Andy Semichuk. Andy, you are a U.S. and Canadian immigration lawyer, so you're going to know a lot about this subject. New marijuana laws in Colorado and Washington State, if there's a Canadian thinking, hey, I'm going to go down and partake in some marijuana in those two states, and they talk about it at the border, what can happen? Okay. Uh, well, there's this clash between federal U.S. law, which prohibits marijuana use and state law which is now allowing marijuana use and immigration is federal law so the last thing you want to do at the border is say I'm going down to use marijuana in Washington or Colorado or any other state because the guys at the border are enforcing federal US immigration law and they're blocking people who are going down to the states on that basis at least according to current regulations so keep your mouth shut. Don't talk about marijuana if right. you're going down to the United States. Now, let's say someone, you know, it's a, kind of a weird one because Washington State borders Canada. Right. Somebody and their buddy, maybe they get in a car, they drive down right to the border. It's Washington State where mar buying marijuana and smoking is legal. Right. And they tell the border guard, well, I'm here to go into Washington State. They show them maybe a newspaper article that says that it's legal. What, what right. can happen? Well, uh, what's going to happen is they're going to say, no, you can't come in here for that reason. Because it's the federal law. Right. Okay. So uh, shut up about that. You go down. <laughs> you know, if you're going to do it, go, but don't talk about marijuana when you're going across the border. Mm -hmm. And uh, here's another little thing. Don't buy marijuana and then think you're going to bring it back to Canada because it's still illegal in Canada. Right. Right. You're going to have to smoke your marijuana in the United States, finish, and then come back to Canada and keep your mouth shut about what you're doing. So the bottom line is when it comes to border stuff, the word drugs, the word marijuana, yeah. It's any a, of this stuff it's a no-no definitely a no-no and of course in the other realms like cocaine heroin and so on those are definitely uh you know inadmissible grounds so right. you know i mean you're just not going to go anywhere with that stuff right but just on visiting on marijuana my suggestion is don't talk about it when you're going across the border nice okay thanks andy you can reach andy at a at pacelawfirm.com also at mywork and we'll talk to you next time bye